going on, man? You guys, you guys want me to jump over the fence? How are we doing? Paul, Paul, Paul how are pleasure you? to meet My you. Pleasure doing to great. Meet you too. Yeah, absolutely. Paul, great to meet you. Paul, nice Paul, nice to meet you. Paul, absolutely. Paul, Paul. Paul and Paul, that's easy. Yeah, it is easy. I like it. Where do you guys want me to sit? Right there. Perfect. Oh, do what do you think through whatever ten days? I feel like uh, this is a wonderful place to be, and I just so can't wait to get to. Uh, you know, continued normal schedule, whatever that I means. Bet, right? I haven't it been on one and yet. it's been a while. What a blissful time for you and your family, knowing you're going to take a step you've always uh, dreamed of, and you're also going to coach in the Super Bowl. What was that week like? I'd be lying if I said I slept a whole lot. That I was bet. one thing, you know, trying to get mm -hmm. some, trying to get some work done and, and, and start that process with the great folks here. Uh, it was early in the morning, late at night. Uh, we already work some pretty good hours as coaches as is, especially when you're going to try to win a Super Bowl. I give, uh, you know, obviously Kwesi and Rob and, and the rest of the Vikings organization so much credit. They actually came to me and said, you know, there's going to be a stopping point here. And, and it was about early on in that game week uh, where we want you to be all in on going to win that game. Awesome. Um, That's right. Which I thought was really special because mm -hmm. they didn't have to do that. And, and they did. Uh, and I was really able to kind of experience, although we were in our home city, you know, sleeping in our own beds, I was able to, as that game week and, and game day kind of came forward, uh, really experience it. And I'll never forget those memories. Wow. And, and it's great because, you know, you come here with a vision of what you want your team to look like now uh, and no better way to, you know, cement that in your mind than, than uh, lifting a Lombardi trophy. You know, obviously my approach to today is it's another example for us to be explaining our vision and, and being able to share uh, where we want to go with not only a now established coaching staff, but through the free agency process and, and what this is really uh, the NFL Combine is all about is these players and, and, and the idea of the draft being how you ultimately, uh, you know, fuel your roster with talent and, and grow from within. But this particular part of the process connecting with our fans through great media members that we have in the NFL, both locally and nationally. I think it's important, and I, and I think it helps share our, uh, you know, our, our shared vision that we have as an organization of where we want to go with this thing. Josh McDaniels. Yeah. He'll be going in his spot. He's two minutes over. He's two minutes over. That's because Pete was, Pete was a couple of minutes over. Really? Over, and then so it's, we're well, back, you, we're back. So what are they, 20 minutes? 15. 15? It'll go fast. Yeah, that'll feel like in a, it'll feel quick compared to that press conference. Yeah. What'd that go, like 45? Hey, buddy. Congratulations. Right, you too, man. You You're too. gonna do great. Yeah, You're it's good to see you. I've been looking for you. Too. Are you, are you here next couple days? Sunday. Oh, perfect. I'm here till Friday. Okay, well, text me if you want to get together. I would love to. All right. Be awesome, right, man. Buddy. Great seeing you. Good to go? Fresh water there. You can oh, stand cool. or sit, whatever Do you, you want to take this one if yep. that's, yeah. Well, first and foremost, uh, appreciate everybody coming out. Um, it's great to be here in Indianapolis. Uh, it's been a long time since I was here as a player, and it's been a few years since uh, I was able to be here as a coach. I, I haven't been, I don't believe, since 2019. So to be, you know, back in Indianapolis, seeing these players go through such a significant part of the process, obviously for them, um, but uh, us as a new staff and kind of building that connection that we're building, this is a huge part of the process for us. You know, I feel good about the guys I'm going to get a chance to do that with both on the staff, uh, but also the players we get to put out on the field. Time for two more. Uh, Nelson, all <laughs> <laughs> but you cannot, you know, just put everybody into a box and say, this is what we're looking for because you're going to miss on, oh, excuse me, you're going to miss on some players that uh, ultimately maybe don't fit a core characteristic but you can find a way to use that player in a way that their potential is maximized and it fits in with the other 10 guys. How are you putting those guys in the best possible situation to have success snap in and snap out? And then what are you building upon that to kind of continue to gain that advantage as games go on, seasons go on, uh, and you just build that sustained success from there? Thank you, guys. Watch out for that thing, Kev. Yeah, where is he? Where is this guy? There he is. I'm good. I'm good. Hey, ho! How are you, man? Congrats, buddy. Thank you, man. Sorry, that, that was a bucket list. <laughs> that was phenomenal. I go, that, Thank didn't, you, Nick. that didn't Congrats. sound about What's up, man? Yeah, how you doing? I like I the sweatshirt, man. Person. Yeah, no, I know. Congrats. I'll talk to you. Yeah. I'm not upset about it. <laughs> it's good to see you, man. Um, yeah, that was a bucket list. Thank you for that. That was phenomenal. He wanted, do, he wanted to do my line. Treating you okay? He's phenomenal. Okay. 
He's phenomenal. You're Thank you. Hands. I'll catch up with you. Yeah, absolutely. All right, you around all week? Yes, sir. Good deal. You know, I got the job, and it's like leading up to it, people kind of know you're in the mix, so you're getting blown up. Then you get the job, and it's like, okay, here's 400 techs. And then you win the Super Bowl. Just when you get it down to about 150, then you win the Super Bowl, and it goes back up to 500, and half those are still techs about jobs. And so then you're, and then like 445 is Mark Wilf, or Mark Wilf texting me. You can't, you can't figure out, yeah, trying to. And you, and you go, wait a minute, I didn't see that, I'm sorry, blah, blah, blah. And, you know, so, and I want to get back to everybody. That's why I'm not like just rolling through it and just trying to like, you know, so it's, uh, it, yeah, it ends up being, it ends up being one of those things where you're like, I'm going to, I'm going to get to this at some point. It might be years from now, but got to do it, you know, to keep the main thing, the main thing, you know? No, nah, definitely. What'd you say? You and Tom are doing I know. How about that? Where, are you not on there? No, they don't let me do anything. For Congrats, man. Thank you so much. Yeah, what are we talking about, man? I want to know about I want to know about that sweatshirt you were wearing yesterday. Was it was it sharp or Sherpa? What is what are we Sherpa? Was it? Yeah, it's very snug. You should absolutely warm. These not to tell you what to do, of course, but these interviews are generally fairly light. You should take as much time as you can to make fun of Tom for various things. I will. I blend in a lot, so you wear something in a crowd that makes everyone at least know it's like, oh, Tom's here. Well, I did not I did not miss shape. you. I saw you right away. You walked in. I said, there's Tom. Yeah. So you accomplish your goal. Yeah. Tom Pelissero with us as well. Hi, I'm Andrew, and this is Kevin O'Connell. Have you had a single moment to have a quieted mind in the last two weeks? I have not, but that's okay. <laughs> uh, you know, I, I would, uh, t if you would have told me a few weeks back that, that we would finish things off and win a Super Bowl, and then I would get to hop on a plane and end up being the, you know, the head coach of the Minnesota Vikings and meet uh, all these great people, all the great people of Minnesota, Nothing more exciting than, than building our coaching staff, solidifying what we want to do there, and then starting to build uh, the connections throughout our whole building uh, for what we hope is a great culture that we can build. Congratulations, by the way, on winning a Super Bowl. We yeah. didn't say that, and good luck with this brave new world. Thank you, guys. Appreciate you.